Hi, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new, my name's Lauren. This afternoon, Christian and I went to this new coffee shop that I found on Instagram, actually. I don't know what I was doing. I was just scrolling through Instagram and I saw the coffee shop and I thought it was cute on the inside. So I wanted to go and check it out. It's actually right by where I work. So we went and it's called Deeply Coffee. Really cute place, super good coffee. It's right in downtown Orlando. So if you live in the area, definitely check it out. Their coffee is really good. And um, yeah, it's right next to like Lake Eola. It's a perfect spot if you're gonna go hang out downtown and walk around Lake Eola or um, grab lunch or something. It's really cute and really good coffee. I was eyeing some of their um, cups that were there displayed on the shelves and I almost went up and asked how much it was because I thought it was so cute but I really don't need any more coffee cups right now but um, yeah this place is so cute really good and um, yeah now I'm just putting my shoes back on I think we're gonna go get some late lunch at Chipotle. So, um, and then I think I'm gonna, oh, Christian, um, Taylor and Maya, um, they're, they're on for dinner. So I'm gonna go to dinner with them. Where are going? Um, what's that place called? Bellini's Tavern. Where is it? It's like right by the hospital on Orange. And then later, yeah, I'm going to dinner with Taylor and Maya. So that's what's going on today. I was excited that I tried this coffee place. <laughs> okay, let's go to Chipotle. I love your mask. Where did you get it? It is 6.30 now. I changed and brushed my hair and like fixed my makeup a little bit. And um, now I'm getting ready to go to dinner with Maya and Taylor. We're going to a place called Delaney's Tavern. I've never been, but I will let you know if it's good for all of the people that watch my videos that live in Orlando. Um, I'll let you know if it's good and I'll let you know what I get. And I'll obviously bring you along and vlog a little bit of it. So, I wanted to show you my outfit. This jacket is very similar to the one that I showed a few weeks ago. That's from Shein. This is from Princess Polly. It's like a corduroy jacket. They're very similar. I don't think Princess Polly has this anymore. I got it in like 2019. So, they may not have it, but they have stuff that's similar. So, just that. Um, I'm wearing the same white top from Aloe Yoga, um, Lululemon leggings, and then these um, platform Superga shoes that I literally always wear. But um, they're just nice for when it's cold and you don't want to wear booties or anything that's with heels on it. So, and I've been wearing these hoops all the time at work. They're from um, Love AJ. And... They're great and I'm becoming obsessed with them again. When I first got them, I was obsessed and then I kind of forgot about them and wore other earrings and I started wearing them to work and I'm obsessed again. They're like the perfect chunky hoop. I'm gonna stop at my mailbox before I go because I got something from Set Active. I also don't know what to do and I don't know if I can go to Apple and like they can fix this or give me a new phone or what it is. I have like a black speck. This lighting is so bad. I have like a black speck in my camera and it could be like a dust particle or something. I don't know. I was Googling it. You can hit your phone really hard, try and wiggle it out. I don't know. I don't want to try anything and break my phone. 
So I don't know, maybe I'll take my phone to Apple and be like, hey, I don't know what to do about this black speck, but it's messy <laughs> with my pictures and videos and stuff. And I guess it's not that serious and it's only on the back camera, it's not on the front camera. So I know it's in the lens. This person has the brightest lights. Um, so I know it's in the, what are you doing? <laughs> so I know it's in the lens, but um, yeah. So I'm gonna go to my mailbox first. It's really, okay, it's not that cold, but it feels cold. It's 61 degrees outside, but this is coming from a Florida girl. So I've never lived anywhere else but Florida. So it's cold to me, very cold. People would probably, people from up north would probably be wearing a short sleeve shirt today. And you're like, oh my gosh, it's so warm. Should I open this? So I got something from Set Active. I just stopped at my mailbox and I really should be going, <laughs> but here we are, I'm so excited. I don't know what it is, but whenever I see something that's sold out, I'm always like, oh, I want it, but I, it's so weird. And then they just, all of a sudden, they told me that they were like, we're not likely gonna restock it because I messaged them I messaged Set Active and was like, hey, are you gonna restock like the oat milk color in the leggings? And they were like, well, it's like a limited time color, so we're sorry that it's out of stock. Like basically like not even telling me that it's gonna come in stock. And then literally like two days later, I get a notification that's back in stock because I sent like an email. So I got the leggings in oat milk. I'll try them on for you tomorrow and let you know how they fit and how they are. Um, they're cheaper than Lululemon leggings and I just wanna like branch out, find different brands of leggings and see what I like and what I don't like and yeah. So I kinda just like wanna branch out and see how they do as well with running, working out. I mean, they're made to be worked out in so <laughs> probably really good but I'll let you know how they are and how they fit. So I'll try them on for you tomorrow. I need to remember, I need to make a mental note to try them on. I'll like leave them on my um, center island so that way I know. But anyways, okay, I'm gonna go. I'm running a little bit late to meet them now because I stopped at my mailbox, but. <laughs> The next day, so I started following this account called AC underscore home cafe. She makes a bunch of like coffees, teas, different drinks. And I found this one and I thought it was just different and I've never tried something like this before. So I wanted to make it. So I picked up some matcha powder and we're gonna make an iced coffee with matcha cold foam. And I'm also gonna be using these iced Nespresso pods that are basically made for iced coffee that I haven't tried yet. They've just been in my bin of coffee that I have stocked up and I figured this would be like the perfect time to try it too. So I think I'm gonna do this espresso shot. I think, yeah, I think I'm gonna do this espresso shot and I think this is a coffee and save the coffee for another time. Basically her recipe is ice espresso milk of choice and then for the matcha cold foam you just combine milk, half a teaspoon, matcha powder, sweetener is optional. I'm not gonna add any sweetener and then froth it. So yeah we'll see how this goes. So I'm gonna just pour milk in it already and I just find that when I pour milk first it kind of helps the coffee the hot coffee not melt the ice that much and then for this 
teaspoon of the matcha powder. I'm gonna crop that. Okay, this is what the matcha looks like. Oh my gosh, I should have cold frothed it. I don't know why I hot frothed it. So since I accidentally hot frothed it, I'm gonna redo it and cold froth it. So that way it's right. Let's see if it's good. This is what it looks like. It's different. It tastes really good though. You have to like matcha powder to enjoy this, but it's really good. I love coming across accounts that do stuff like that and branch out and try different things because then it kind of inspires me to try different things. So I love it. I haven't vlogged all day today, which honestly was very nice. Definitely needed it. But I wanted to show you the leggings that I got from Set Active. They're the Sculpt Flex leggings in oat milk. So they actually are a really good length. I'm 5'2", so they don't have a lot of extra fabric at the bottom. I really do like the color. They have this little like detail all down the side of the leg. We'll see how they hold up during a workout. I'm a little worried about the waistband becoming loose after you like start sweating, like hoping that doesn't happen. But that's the only worry because, um, I don't know, I feel like I have that, that issue with Gymshark leggings where they like get loose. But I think they remade their leggings to where they're more cinched at the waist so they don't get loose. Anyways, I'm going to take a bath. I come in the extra bathroom. I have my Key Lime LaCroix. And I'm gonna light this candle. I got it for Christmas. Actually, it smells really good, super relaxing. I also use this Dr. Teal's Foaming Bath. I like it, it smells good, relaxing. This thing lasts forever because you don't need to pour a lot. But um, yeah, so I'm doing that. <laughs>